What is up, everybody? Big Ox Triple Six here, the golf gamer. So check it out, man. I can't believe it's been almost four years. Well, two months will be four years since the PS5 came out, man. It's crazy, you know. And been looking at people hype with Astrobot. Trying to figure out why everybody's so excited for a platformer, you know? Don't get me wrong. I like platformers. I bought Mario Mario Wonder for for a whole lot cheaper price on QVC. If you actually follow Warrior 64, you'll have a bunch of um games about $34, $35 on QVC if you have a new account and stuff. But it sucks! That you can't remove your freaking card. Other than that, I would have been bought, bought a few more games on there. But it is what it is. Um, one to talk about is still some controller. Three years ago, I said this mofo was going to be a gimmick. Like, not that many people was going to utilize the controller. Heck, even Sony. First party, first party stuff. Hasn't really utilized this controller, man. I I still try to figure out why everybody's so so high praise with this controller. This mofo is supposed to have awesome adaptive triggers. <laughs> Excuse me. And mind blowing haptics. You know the only game I still give praise to that actually utilized that controller. One game, uh, Sifu, it was just like spots here, here and there. Astro Playroom, that was included in your PS5. Great, great little platformer. Awesome platformer. And Astro, a new Astro Bot game came out, what? Last week? Good stuff? Had hard, hardcore Metacritic, like 94, 95, must play and stuff. Grow men. Like grow men all excited. I'm just I'm just like like what? <laughs> like what are you signing for for a freaking Sony platformer? You need support Concord? Those same Sony people that shut down a bunch of Japanese studios, like um Japan studios that made made a few games. The Last Guardian, freaking what, Gravity Rush, um all those games. Freaking shut down some of the VR studios too, you know. But they're excited for a freaking platform. But that's that's besides the point. But um, that's the only game like Astro Block and uh, Astro Block, Astro Astro Playroom, Astro Bot are the, are the ones that's going going to use last controller because I was talking to my coworker. He said he um he got it for his kid and he was being impressed by the controller. I was just like. <laughs> <laughs> just like yeah I'm not surprised I, I'm not because it's a freaking gimmick it really is now this mofo right here it's not as worse than a 6 axis <laughs> I remember they Sony took out the rumba feature just to put the 6 axis in there just doing motion and all that type of stuff yeah you guys know know what I'm talking about. Lair, um, Heavenly Sword, Dark Sector. Yeah, those, those were fun doing that. I think it was um, um, crap. That one game. Um, oh my mom, my mom, my mind's freaking going blank here. No more heroes. Yeah, that use that as well. And that was about it. They're like, she should, she should go away and stuff. <laughs> But this one, playing, I was playing Call of Duty, dude. The, 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 the adaptive trigger, shooting people and stuff. You barely even feel anything. Barely. I remember them actually trying to praise this stuff when playing Call of Duty Black Ops when it first came out. I bought my PS5. I, it came, it was like 800 bucks. I bought 
got from Ant Online, which I never heard of. I got Call of Duty Black Ops. I got Spider Man. I think Moth Bros Ultimate Edition came with the original the original Spider Man remastered. Um, the Last of Part Two, Demon and Demon Souls. So that was like eight hundred dollars and stuff plus a plus an extra controller. And Black Ops Cold, Cold War, Black Ops Cold War, whatever. Hard to use the mofo. It was actually stronger for the half of feedbacks compared to uh, Black Ops 6. Which, matter of fact, I'm, I'm going to let you guys know. That that Omni, Omni movement? Trash. <laughs> Trash. Too many buttons just to go dive, spin around, lay on your back, shoot, 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 shoot. It's too many buttons. Way too many buttons. I just use my slide and, and freaking move on. You know how Call of Duty is. Go in there, shoot some people. If you die, respawn. Go in there, shoot some people, die, respawn. Even though I got my uh, digital code from a website, because I didn't want to pay full price for the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, because I mostly play a story and stuff. Yeah, for 20, 23 bucks, I'm trying to get my get my money's worth out that mofo about 24, 25 hours out, out that thing. I haven't played story yet, but they have Black Ops freaking six beta, open beta, and eh, <laughs> I think it's worth the Modern Warfare 2, to be honest, because you got to be strategic in the multiplayer. You can't just run in there and freaking go kamikaze in that mofo because you're going to get shot up quick. You got to freaking be careful, crouch yourself, but that's, that's besides the point. Barely feel the thing shooting people. And I have it on a maxed, strong, maxed, barely feel anything. The thing's a gimmick. Always be a gimmick. And, and it's... Tsh, tsh, tsh. The honest, I don't understand how y'all praise, praise this controller. I, I don't. I don't. It, it has the worst battery life out, out, of, out of the PlayStation series. This... This right here lasts longer. Even though y'all complain about the complain about the controller, that lasts longer than the PS5. That's saying a lot. <sighs> a lot. But it is what it is. I think my food just just I have to eat some fries and stuff. Yeah, my food just I think is beef in the oven. I got. It. Check on the fries, see if I got flipping and stuff on my oven. But anyways, that's about it, man. Um, will always be a gimmick. Always be a gimmick. I was right. <laughs> I was right. But that's about it, man. Ah, my nose itchy, cold out here, and stuff. And I gotta figure out what I'm gonna. Watch because I can't watch my wrestling unless I um, go to Netflix and pay for that stuff. And I'm not going to. It was on Hulu for a while and it got freaking switched out to, to USA and stuff and, and Netflix. So I'm like, no, nah, I ain't doing that. If I do stick with Hulu, I have to pay like $75 a month just to watch some wrestling because like the live sports stuff. I'm like, no, nah, I'm not going to do that. So, uh, I was enjoying wrestling for a little while, but it is what it is. But anyways, guys, I'm rambling on. I'm done. Hope you guys have a wonderful Monday. Um, play some more Call of Duty. I'll probably finish the story and stuff, but that's about it, guys. Have a good one. Stay awesome. Stay healthy. And watch our for those. I'm about to sneeze, but you ain't going to see me on camera sneezing. Bye, guys. Have a good one.